at Cornerstone Family. This is Pastor Tim. It is day number four for me with COVID-19, and uh, we are surviving. But I thought I'd give you an update on something a little bit different, and that is on the love that we find in the local church. And I had noticed it somewhat before I became ill with COVID-19, but once I became ill, it became so plain as day to me. Now, there's been a huge cross-section of our church family that anytime somebody has come down with COVID-19 has uh, stepped up to the plate and said, hey, um, I'd like to help. Um, uh, what can I do to help so-and-so? And, uh, and, and so a huge cross-section. But there is a particular segment of our church who has led the way in showing love. And that segment are those who are the most COVID cautious people that we've had. In other words, those who were the earliest and first to mask up, to shelter in place, to distance, to, um, to get their vaccines, everything. And, uh, and, and those are the same people who are mowing lawns, uh, running groceries, running money, doing work for other people, doing their work for them. And uh, it's just been, uh, it's just been remarkable. And in a world where the world is kind of saying, uh, you know, if you haven't gotten your vaccine yet, we're out of compassion for you. Uh, here I sit, somebody who is vaccine hesitant. I have not been vaccinated. And uh, you, you kind of, when you get COVID-19, you kind of fear judgment for that. And what I have found in the church among those who would be the most... Uh, cautious and the first to vaccinate, excuse me, uh, what I have found among those who would be the first to vaccinate is no judgment, uh, total love, total compassion, uh, just how can I serve? And it has just been remarkable to see. And, uh, and, and so, uh, you know, and it's not just, you know, it's not just one family, it's not just two. Uh, there are three COVID cautious families that have just gone overboard for us and for others. I put one of them through a $170 uh, Costco shopping trip. Um, and uh, if you can imagine shopping for someone else at Costco, I mean, if you don't normally buy pesto, um, uh, pesto, uh, what do you call it? Uh, pesto sauce and fresh mozzarella, uh, you know, where do you get those things? And, and anyway, we, we put him through that and, and he did a stellar job for us. And We've had uh, good food ever since. But anyway, I just praise God for that. A couple of verses come to mind. Uh, uh, first off, First Timothy 5.25, So also good works are conspicuous, and even those that cannot remain, uh, that, that are not conspicuous cannot remain hidden. And then First Peter 3.8, Finally, all of you have unity of mind, sympathy, brotherly love, a tender heart, a humble mind. Do not repay evil for evil or reviling for reviling, but on the contrary, bless. For to this you were called that you may obtain a blessing. So I just want to say thank you. As somebody who is a uh, uh, vaccine hesitant and come down with COVID and now wait to see what happens, I, I'm afraid of this COVID as well. Um, but now we are in it and going to see what happens. But I just appreciate the priority of love and, and uh, the lack of judgmentalism I have felt as you have ministered to me. Uh, as far as an update goes, uh, at the moment, uh, I'm probably feeling 90% there. Earlier today, probably 70% there. It, it vacillates. Uh, temp is around. I woke up with a great temp this morning, um, and, uh, and, and it was up as high today as 100.4. But um, anyway, uh, the, the family seems to be all doing well. The Skirins seem to be all doing well. Um, the, um, none of us will be in church this Sunday. None of them will be in church this Sunday. Um, they, they've got enough symptoms uh, that, that even if it were day 10, and I'm not sure for them it would quite be day 10 after day 10. So um, I think they'll all be in. Um, I'm outside right now because the kids are watching some guardian owl movie, something. Uh, we've been hanging out, cooking food, watching movies, getting out and walking when we can, and, um, and uh, just trying to do what we can to stay healthy. So anyway, appreciate it. Love you all. We'll see you soon.